safety guidelines that that decision is made on. And a follow up. Um, any idea how long we will remain in phase two? Because obviously there's uh, a lot of questions about you know not just high school football but also professional football where we have these safe games. And I know that um, seems ticket holders are, are hoping to get back to the dome for the 927 game. What, what are the thoughts on that? Mm -hmm. Um, you know, again, we don't, we haven't gotten any information from the state on what phase three looks like. So for now, you know, we, we are in the phase that we are in until we receive more information. And again, well, you know, I don't, I don't know how to say it until kids get back in school. Right. That's the priority around here. So um, kids are the priority in school instruction and that will, as we move forward, um, we'll measure um, how well we do and continue to rotate, you know, public uh, school students back into that classroom until we are at 100 percent. And of course, with parents continuing to have the option of virtual versus on-site instruction, that is the priority. I apologize. It's kind of a similar question, but we have mm -hmm. a lot of questions. I'm going to make it hopefully as simple as possible. Yes or no, can high schools play football starting today in October in the city of New Orleans? Yes or no? I just answered that question. But it wasn't, with all due respect, I think there's a lot of confusion. With all due respect, phase two, what confusion? We've been in phase two, we will remain in the phase two, the guidelines are very clear. So yes or no, can high schools play football? Phase two, I'm what sorry. does it say? I'm just asking yes or no. Well, I'm asking, no, you're asking me a question, however, you thoroughly understand what phase two means. You also understand the guidelines that are in place, and that's where the city of New Orleans will remain as it relates to Football. So I have one more question. Sorry. Just to be clear, there are. Well, no, I mean, I'm, I'm not. I'm, that's not the question. So the question. It's yes or no. I think people watching this want to know yes or no. As of now, in the phase two guidance in the city of New Orleans, contact sports are not allowed. There are guidance that allow for non contact drills which the schools have all been doing. So what a football team could do two days ago, they can continue to do today, as of now, until we see how, how LHSAA has any plan to keep children and coaches safe. That will not change until we can figure that out. How is Tulane practicing football and how are the Saints playing on Sunday in the city of New Orleans? So the Saints have applied to the state from a workplace for a workplace exception, that, they, that this is their place of work. The LHSIA does not govern Tulane football. Okay. Thanks, Robert. But what about the city? Isn't Tulane in the city of New Orleans? Yeah. So yeah. how are they practicing contact sports on a campus in the city of New Orleans? I haven't had a conversation with Tulane about what they're practicing or not practicing. But they were practicing for a month. Let's yeah. Sorry. Let's go. Sorry. Yeah. Dominique. 